thing for you has just been just contests. Like on on wings here, you are on a rike. Just strong closeouts. There's a block there. Just being able to slide your feet, make strong contests. Is that sort of what coach will be saying to you? Just like make aggressive closeouts and just be there for um, on the perimeter. Because I know some teams they'll want to be more conservative on, the, on those plays, not try to get in fouls. But for you, I think that's a big add for you using your length on the perimeter. Yeah. So I would say like, if I'm thinking about like, if I'm on offense and someone like, when are you most uncomfortable? It's like when someone's in your grill, especially mm-hmm. with someone like Arike, she gets really um, comfortable when she's able to get space and she's getting her dribble going. Like if I can make her think about it, like try to probe me, go a different way. She's not as much in her rhythm. And then I know she's trying to get to that left side. So she, she got me with a, a move, but I know like I see my help side. So she sees the help side. So she knows it has to be a pull up. So I just need to make sure that I recover well, making sure that I'm not fouling her, knowing that I'm going to block with my left hand and she's shooting. So make sure I don't come across her, but making sure that like I recover well and I at least make that shot hard so that's my biggest thing making making you uncomfortable I need them to do a better job of like making sure going to their offhand because she did mm-hmm. get to her left hand but right. still I think I mean help with that my teammates they were in the right position for help side so it stopped her from getting to the basket but just making her take a contested hard shot all right then here we see you you start off ball just strong contest um yeah just even on this possession we just see just yeah just being able to navigate understand where just communicate there you are just being able to yeah. take switch as well. So I I play with McBride, played against her, and I she's a knockdown three point shooter, right. and she does a good job. Like she's getting screens, she does a good job of using her screens, getting her body set for that shot. When I see her coming across V right here, and I don't see a red jersey. I'm like, okay, I got to know. I have to go out there, at least contest that shot, mm-hmm. knowing that she's getting off fast, knowing that sometimes, like, she might kick her feet a little bit. So I can't go all the way because I don't want to, like, uh, foul mm-hmm. a three-point shooter. But making sure I contest it and try to tip it, and I was able to tip it there. All right, then here are just some of what you can do on the ball. Um, in transition, block on fee. And then here we have one drone on defense against Melissa Smith, just sort of like an isolation here. Um, you got Monique on the weak side. We also got um Ari in that other side corner. Just being able to be there is just one yeah. thing. You can do well, there just one on one, um, offensive rebound. Just I think too with the first two with feed knowing she wants to go left she's strong left so I know that's going up right away so I gotta make sure I can test that I I see that like she's starting to slow down a little bit so that's when I was able to recover to get that mm-hmm. shot with Smith she's trying to go right and when she turned back and thankfully Mo was there too to help that but she turned back I did my job for not for her not to go right so with or without Mo like that was part of the scheme and I was going to be able to get to that shot because that's a harder shot for her she can make that but it's a harder shot for her and then for Elizabeth here she's going up like deep in the paint she's going up so I want to make sure I try to get the ball at the flight not when she's necessarily going up because that could be tough for a foul so making sure I get it when it's when she's releasing it Mm -hmm. and then is this Stewie yeah we have one right here on Stewie one-on-one yeah just just strong because Stewie's the type of player where she doesn't really have, like, she doesn't win with physicality, per se. She wins with just her length, being able to like, manipulate angles, position her body because her, her shot height is so great. But you're just there in position with verticality. Yeah, here, Stewie is always just making yeah. it making it tough for her. There. Strong contest at the rim. And then just a couple of things here, just your help defense. Um. You're starting on the weak side on Alyssa Thomas again. You held back. That one was a little... <laughs> we were helping, and I I didn't need to help as much. Thankfully, I was able to recover. But Bree yeah, Jones, over, you, yeah, you kind of did. I overhelped in that yeah. one. It was OT overhelped. I wanted to make sure that I was able just in case if she spin back. But CP had great defense there. Um, I mean, she's a great passer. Clearly, sees AT, and thankfully, I was just able to recover well get that shot like block the shot but at least my goal is just contest it try to block it but like not get a foul in this situation just play tough defense and make it hard for them to score at all times we got one more again that's knowing the scout knowing that carrington when she's going right she's going right 
I didn't see um, anyone with her. So I knew that I had to help and try to contest that shot, knowing that she's, she's going hard, right? Like it's going up. Yeah. Haley kind of got caught in the screen here and you're just like in yeah. great position. And the benefit of here, just Alyssa Thomas can't really shoot. So you're able to kind of commit a little bit more on that drive, mm -hmm. um, knowing that she can't um, really take a jumper. 